Hello everyone. Today we are going to be looking at the in operator as part of our PostgreSQL series. If you have not watched my previous video as part of this series, I will highly encourage you to go and watch those first before jumping on this one. And if you are new right here, I highly encourage you to subscribe and press on the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever we drop our videos. All right, guys. Now let us understand what the in operator does or how do we use the in or how we use the in operator. But before that, let's first of all run this query right here, this simple query, select star from actor table. As this is part of the DVD rental database that we have been using in our in this series. If I execute these, very good, you can see that this ran successfully and gave us 200 rows. So what are the columns we have? Actor ID, first name, last name, last update. Okay. But what if you have been asked to list the actors whose actor ID is either 2, 4, 7, 11, or 17? How do we write that? You want to list the actors that the actor ID is either two four seven eleven or seventeen and i have shown you how to do this type of thing previously where you use the where clause this is where you add the condition right you are using the where to add the condition that where the actual id is equal to two or the actual id equals to four or the actual id equals to seven or the actual id equals to actual id equals to eleven or the actor ID equals to 17. Okay, take note. Remember, we have 200 rows here when we did not put any condition. Now we have these conditions. Let us execute and let us see. If I execute, good, this ran successfully. Now you can see that we have returned the actors that the actor ID is either 2 or 4 or 7 or 11 or 17 you can see that we got this right here but what did we use we used a lot of the all operator what about if you have been asked to also list as part of 247 11 17 actor id let's say you also ask to list 19 21 23 25 27 29 that means you are going to keep using the all statement that is going to be too lengthy and that's going to be wasting a lot of time. Instead of doing that, we can just use the in operator. How do we write that as part of the condition? I'm going to delete this. Okay, I'm going to delete this. And in that case, how do I write this? I will say where actor ID in, I like to write that in capital, uh, uppercase, in, put a bracket, and then type those specific values that you want as part of the list that you want to come out in your query. So we want 2, 4, 7, 11, 17. Remember that we want 2, 4, 7, 11, 17. You know what? Let us take this out first. Let us return it back to what it was before so that we can, you know, when we run this, we will we'll be able to justify that this changed or these are uh, or this is correct or not what we are doing is correct or not let us take out this i'm going to cut that i'm going to rerun this again okay now you can see that we are back to what it was before all the rows 200 rows okay now let me put my condition now using in you can see i have where actor id in 247117 okay if i run this what do i have very good guys you can see this has run successfully now we have actor id 2 4 7 11 17 five rows as what well, just like what we add when we use the all statement you can see that writing your query like this instead of using a lot of the all statement this saves you a lot of time so now when do you use the in statement when you find yourself using a lot of all operator then in that case you can just put those values inside this command using the in operator 
right so instead of let's say the question ask you to also list uh let's say the question has to also list 19 21 23 say 25 you know say 27 you know so let's assume we want to list all these as part of our query as part of our output what we want to return you can see that this is a lot of values right here so instead of you writing a lot of all statement just put all this in this bracket using this in operator let me run that and let us see what happens very good this runs successfully you can see now that we have our all our actors with actor id 2 4 7 11 17 19 21 23 25 27 that is exactly what we have in right here you can see that this saves you a lot of time instead of writing a lot of the all using the all operator i hope you understand this right now this is pretty easy guys instead of writing a lot of your query using a lot of all operators you can just put it in uh, uh, in a bracket using the in operator okay you can see that 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 is pretty easy guys i hope you understand this i will encourage you to practice more examples using this dvd rental database uh, so that you can better understand this okay all right guys again if you have not subscribed to our channel i will highly encourage you to subscribe because uh, as part of this series we are going to be looking at a lot of fundamentals beginner level intermediate and advanced level things in this postgre sql stay tuned as we bring out more videos don't forget to turn up the no to turn on the notification bell to be notified whenever we release uh, any of our videos all right guys i'm going to be we are going to be i'm going to meet you in the next uh, video where we are going to be looking at another operator thank you guys bye